I am from Plateau State, Nigeria, and I am an actor by profession. My ideal partner would be a lady with very pretty nails. Like, I get attracted to ladies with very pretty and neat toe and finger nails. And then um, she has to be pretty, slim, not too fleshy, and then um, fashionable also and outspoken. My pet peeve is caginess. That is being too secretive. I'd always want to be informed when sensitive matters arise. My deal breaker in a relationship are being too materialistic and pretend. Because as for me, I love dressing really good. And then I love my woman to be also fashionable and dress out whenever we go out. Really? <laughs> Take a look at us. Mm. You see, I, I, ain't we looking good? Mm -hmm. Definitely, you girls are looking then you very pretty. imagine our sister, mm -hmm. just mm. like us. Even in the kitchen. And so many things in common. Yeah. Our hearts are different. Of course. And you know what? She's an introvert, I told you, yeah? Yeah. I think we're the only talkative here in the family. Mm -hmm. And she is so the opposite of us. Yo, guys, but hold up. Blessing just said she double dates. Ha! I'm a bit scared. I just, like, I'm just imagining going out on a date with him. I would love to be with this kind of person. That's nice. That's nice. Well, you don't mind me asking, do you pray? I do, I do, actually. If you're I That's do very, very does. essential. I'm telling you, like, see, the thing is, if you're not good fairy and if you're not open to new things, man, you can easily just walk out that door because, mm. man, this is not the like, this is not the setting for you at all. Cool. So, um, I think I think I can deal, but let's just see how it goes, though. So, what's her motivation like? Okay, he's a nice communicator. He seems to like know what he wants for, or will I say, in a lady. Thank you very much. So it I was hope. not. I hope it was not difficult. Look, you see this place. No, no, no. It wasn't. A little bit difficult, but I think oh, okay. with a little rest, I'll be good. Oh. Augustine is not really my spec. He's dark. He's tall. He's okay, actually, but I don't like bearded guys. So the beard is kind of off for me. Like seriously. So all my dressing was just for a wine. Wow. Whatever guys will come around. Please, just stick. I'm, I'm done. Uh, like, communicating with you. Can I tell you one thing? Trust me, this is the gospel truth. You are a very beautiful lady, and nobody should tell you otherwise. Oh, welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Hey, you. And your friend, take it. I love you to do this. Aww. <laughs> yeah. You really do have great taste. Mm. Obviously, I do. If I don't, I wouldn't be here with you. And guess what? What do you think about this light? It's actually supposed to light up this place, yes? Yeah. But funny enough, you are actually lighting up it. The light. That's why I can't stand you by dangling. Happy. <laughs> See now, permit me to breathe. You actually look beautiful once again. Thank you. Let me take your cold away, please. Yeah. Oh my God. Augustine just gave me his blazer. That is so thoughtful of him. Like, he's just so caring, extremely caring, and I really love that about him. Mm -hmm. Are you always this sweet to all your girlfriends, or it's just me? No, I'm actually this sweet to you. Um, so, is there anywhere you'd love to travel to? Mm. I would love to travel to Santorini via Milan. Are you serious? Yeah. Well, I actually have a place in mind, but trust me, I can put you outside. Can we go together? No, tell me yes. I actually want to go to somewhere in Spain. Okay. Yeah. But I don't care about that anymore. I'd want to go to anywhere you want to go to. Can I? That's so sweet of you. Spain is out. Santorini in. Um, would you like to go on another date with me? Just both of us alone. Of course, I would love to. Okay. I would love to go on another date with Anita because I enjoyed my time with her and I think there's something that could grow here. Yeah. 